A small community in Texas is in mourning. At least 50 churchgoers in Sutherland Springs, just outside of San Antonio, targeted by a lone gunman, 26 killed. The news shocking many, including the church community on Guam. They all walked into church that morning thinking they were just going to go worship and be with people that they were safe with. And then uh, to have someone come in with a gun and, and uh, kill so many, uh, it's almost beyond words. It's a day that we set aside for the, to, to worship the Lord and uh, it's, it's unconceivable that uh, it's inconceivable that can, that can happen. Jared Baldwin is the executive pastor at Harvest Baptist Church. Pastor Rhonda Guzman is at the Pacific Revival Center. Both church leaders in disbelief over what happened, but they say they do have plans in place to protect their congregation. We've done active shooter training with the Guam Police Department and the Marshals, and so we've done a lot of that preparation. We do have a security force now, you know, in the church that's uh, very diligent. Uh, in the event that the worst case scenario happens. And adding action to their faith, both sharing their thoughts and prayers for those affected. Pray for that church family because, uh, uh, you know, it's just uh, so heart-wrenching. Um, and not to lose faith. And standing together for what they believe in. You can't live in fear. Um, I think that evil wins if we just close everything down and be afraid and don't... Uh, just continue to meet and assemble. It's one of our rights as Americans. And so no matter what church you go to, don't live in fear. 